under Don Kelly, Humanity 101. What is that? I'm glad you asked. I want to give you this pen. And you can wear this if you will do one favor for me. What's that? You have to take a pledge. And the pledge is that you're going to be a really good human being. You're going to do, it's going to give, it'll give hands and feet to whatever you like to do best. So you can wear that. And you, you got more. If you want more, I can get it for you. Here's the pledge. And there's a piece of paper. Here's the, the word. The, there is the, you toggle that in, and you'll go directly to the page. Here's the pledge. First, there's compassion. Now, I know you enough to know. I can tell by the look on your face that you know what compassion is, and you have it. Is that right? That's right. Okay. Empathy. Empathy is not sympathy. It's what, if you cut your finger, I believe that's empathy. Hmm. Forgiveness. You gotta forgive others. And more importantly, you have to forgive yourself for being human. Integrity. Now I know you have integrity because uh, you've said two words to me and it just, integrity just comes right out of you. And there's kindness. And kindness is akin to integrity. You can't have integrity unless you have kindness. And there's respect. You can't have respect unless you have kindness and integrity and you have self-reflection or you wouldn't know what you're doing. And when you do self-reflection, you find out that you did something wrong that day. Don't forget forgiveness of yourself. You have as many of those as you want. So I understand, I have to write that paragraph of what I have done. Okay. It can be two to three sentences. Yep. But it's, I'll make it as short as possible. Okay. It's the work that I have done through Rotary. Okay. Helping people. Okay. But now this is the most important work. And you know when I recognized it? When you were at a Rotary Club and you had this banner out there. And I looked at it and I looked back at you and you were, you were talking and I thought, my goodness, that would be hands and feet to my ministry. Mm -hmm. That's really important because people understand that intuitively, even though they don't right. know what it right. means exactly. Right. Sometimes they ask me. I said, well, if you go up to a friend and you tell him he gives a hand and feet, that means that you have expanded your ministry to talk to that to another person, right. and they may carry it on. Well, I like well, that top to bottom, too. Yeah. So, and, and I'm having phenomenal success at churches. I, mm -hmm. I can't believe it. Well, it makes sense, though. Too so I mean, you why? should be. Should that that should be one of the first places? But we what this we like is, to make this sure. This is what Christians should do every day. Right. <laughs> but what we what we want to make sure though is that because sometimes there are people who can practice these and they can have a different faith system. But certainly, if we're talking about this, it should be one of the things that grounds how you be a decent human being. So I like that. That's very good.